the heck is this out here? Did I just drain the water? Did this do something for me? The heck is... What? Welcome to the Vanish Cap Switch course. All the blue blocks you find will become solid once you step on the cap switch. Did I just accidentally discover the final cap switch? It'll disappear when you put it on the Vanish Cap, so you'll be able to elude enemies and walk through many things. Try it out. What? I want that red coin. Oh my goodness, I almost missed that. Camera is sometimes not the best. Thanks for fall damage. <laughs> Whatever, I guess. Okay. Oh, I'll take it. I need it. I need this too. <laughs> He's gonna keep on taking fall damage unless I do this. Oh, don't slide off. Please don't slide off. Oh my goodness, it's so scary. Yeah, good old slider music. Okay. Four. Hmm. Don't slide off the edge. Please don't slide off the... Okay. Um. Let's yoink these real quick. There's gotta be four more coins out here somewhere. And there must be like the blue switch. Okay. What? That damages me. Maybe that like semi-circle thing is a good strategy for the... For the backflip. Oh, don't you dare fall. No! Oh. I appreciate it, Cam. Did I miss any one of them? I don't think so. Oh, crap. I'm gonna fall off the edge in some stupid way right at the end. It's water again? I have to go drain it once more for that? Are you kidding me? Oh, never mind. It just puts me there. I would have been so mad for a hot second. Yeah, I know. I know, you told me. So, this way. Oh. Don't you love fall damage in platformers? <laughs> okay, boobity bop. I will happily take the one-ups, though. I mean, I could just slide down to avoid it. Maybe. My, my. Do a kick before you land? Does that, like, cancel my fall damage or something? Oh, it does a dive. Whoa! Why did I change to, like, low polygon again? Why does that happen sometimes? I mean, it does, like, a dive. I don't know how to do a kick. Well, you're not supposed to dive, but... Well, the kick button is... Is why. And sometimes I just dive instead. And I don't know what determines it. Yeah, I become, like, low polygon. Well, lower polygon for a hot second for some reason. And I don't get why. I wanted to do a backflip, but I mean... Okay, I mean... Okay... So now I know they flip around that weird way. Grab... The thing! Thank you! Grab! Okay, now I know they flip around in that weird way. Okay, this didn't help me. In fact, it just took away some of my thing. I'm just gonna long jump it, or not. I'm here now. What the heck is going on? Whoa! Oh, come on! Look how much fun I'm having right now with this game. At least I'm gaining lives because there's the things here. Oh, that time it kicked. That time it dove. I don't get what determines, like, what are the other? No. Oh. At least I gain like a net of two lives each time I do this. So there's that. Maybe if I'm holding a direction. I was holding no direction that time and it did a dive. What if I hold forward then? Oh, direction equals kick and no direction equals dive? Is that it? You'd think it'd be the reverse, right? One would think. Hmm. That wasn't a backflip like I hoped. Okay. I hate this part. I hate this part so much. <laughs> it sucks. Um. I want a backflip, but what you gonna do? I hate this part here. It sucks.
and holding a direction that time did a dive instead of a kick. I don't get it. I really don't get it. I don't understand how many tries this is gonna take. Freaking, I know! Thanks for telling me though. Oh. Yeah, so no direction is dive, and then if I hold forward. No, it did a dive anyway! I don't get it! Sometimes it's dive, sometimes it's kick. I don't know what determines it either way. Literally no idea. Not even a single clue. Can I jump over here, please? Thank you. Okay, there's the four. So then we slide down here. Okay, yeah, sometimes I become like even lower polygon. Wonky. I just can't do a backflip on that spot for some reason. Okay, get me over there. Get me on over here, how about? Grab that red coin. And then grab this one too. Like what timing am I supposed to use here anyway? Oh, come on! Like, what is the timing supposed to be? You'd think, like, maybe the thing that I'm currently on and the one on the other side will be staggered. So it's like, this one flips and I can go on it right before my one flips and starts going down. But no, they flip at the exact same time, meaning I literally have to hop for a different platform that's lower, that's out of my field of view, and just hope that I land on it and don't slide off. Because good game design! <laughs> What the heck? What the heck, man? I cannot believe this. Oh, my nose. Okay. Like, you'd think, from a game design standpoint, that they would stagger, like, the order in which those two flip. But no, they're the exact same time. So I can't jump from the one of mine that's about to flip onto the one on the other side that's about to flip. I need to jump to the lower thing that's literally outside of my line of sight. That is not how to design good platforming stuff. Like, look, this one flips at the same time as that one. So I have to jump for this thing and just hope I land on it, which apparently I did this time. Oh my goodness, man. I literally just have to hope I get lucky, which luckily I did that time. Ugh. Oh, come on. Freaking! This has got to be one of the worst design levels I've ever seen in my life! What the heck? What the heck? Oh, man, now I literally can't get all the red coins. So I'm just hopping off. Now I just have to cross my fingers I get as lucky as I did that one time, again. For, for those several jumps. Do I literally need to backflip off that last one when the game likes to not let me backflip? My goodness gracious. Not okay. Not one bit okay. Like, at least on a upside, I'm gaining lives. So there's that, I guess. Don't slide off, please. My oh my. This has got to be some of the most frustrated I have been with a single player game. Probably since my playthrough of Assassin's Creed Liberation with that freaking water tower mission. Like, I think this is probably the most frustrated I've been with a single-player game on stream since then. That or that one time in Breath of the Wild semi-recently where I was trying to bomb launch in that one shrine and I kept not working. I was pretty frustrated with that too. Um, okay. Great, my favorite part. Well, let's just hope I get lucky with this, I guess. Nope. Man, I love aiming for a platform that I can't even see. That's, it's, it's really fun. Can you see how much fun I'm having? Because it's so much. 
So much fun. So much that I can't even contain my excitement. And I've now gone closer to monotone. <laughs> my oh my. Yoink the thing. Thank a you. <sighs> Oi. Oi. Grab these coins. Thank a you. I literally hate this level. I hate this level in specific so much. I think this has got to be my least favorite level we've played so far in this game. And I mean, there have been some ones that have definitely frustrated me, to say the least. Okay, you wank that. Grab this. What if I go on this lower thing here and then- Is that the play? Is that actually the play right there? But then I need to get up to here. Before the thing flips, oh my goodness, I made it. Okay, so we now have all three cap switches just unlocked. Okay. Does that let me get through there? Maybe? Okay, it does. It's over. This miniature hell is over! My goodness, so not okay. I guess now we'll go into like the attic or something area? We covered a lot of the basement. I know it's not 100 percent but if there's any other areas down there, I couldn't find them easily. So I mean, also my joints are freaking cracking from being so done with this game now, apparently. Um, well, no. Dang it. Dang it, man. Well, I can see myself potentially working towards like 100% ish with Mario Galaxy with, oh my goodness, with how much of a special place it holds in my heart. I can see myself streaming through that just for fun. But with how freaking Mario 64 has been going, I think this one, I'm probably just gonna beat it and that's it. Like nothing extra after that. It's the way I see this going at this point because holy crap. What the heck? All right, so now I'll go into the upper area and check stuff out over there, methinks. So, what is up here since we've checked out the other areas and gotten like a whole bunch of the stars at least from them? What is this? What? What? There's a painting in Mario 64 that's just a literal painting? 